police, another officer involved shooting involving Berkeley County deputies, and now the suspect wanted in the one early this morning that started a search for two suspects considered armed and dangerous ends with one of those suspects wounded and on the way to the hospital. Let's go back out to that scene. College Park Road, Highway 17A. We have team coverage and Laura Smith picking it up now. We have Colby Thielen out there as well. But Laura, uh, things unfolded pretty quickly from when we started at 11 o'clock this morning uh, and we heard sirens right at the end of your live shot and that's when things really kicked into high gear. Yep. It sure did, uh, Brad. And, you know, we started at the neighborhood because that's where the chase ended early uh, this morning. And then these suspects fled on foot. And then uh, deputies been looking for these suspects through the night and through uh, this morning, heading into the afternoon hours now. So. Then we came here right here on the corner of College Park Road and North Main Street, and um, you can see that there have this shut off. You cannot take a left from College Park Road onto North Main Street. We just talked to a deputy. They will have this area shut down for a while, so you will have to be uh, take a right here onto North Main Street. But Brad, like we just said, uh, after our live shot uh, around 11, you know, 05 this morning, we just came came over here to the corner where uh, North Main Street meets College Park Road. We heard for what appeared to be gunshots uh, fired about four of them. We also heard from people here at the gas station. They also heard gunshots uh, early uh, earlier, just a few minutes uh, before we found out that the subject was uh, shot and taken into custody. Ricky Dwayne Johnson. So you can see this is the scene right here. Sheriff deputies, uh, Charleston County also on scene. You can see canine units uh, blocking off a portion of North Main Street uh, right past the Sphinx gas station. Uh, this is certainly uh, some good news as they do have one suspect in custody, but the other uh, as of right now we are not, we have not learned is in custody. So certainly if you are heading in this direction, you are not going to be able to turn on uh, to North Main Street heading towards the Somerville area and it's going to be shut down for some time because there's a lot of people out here at uh, police presence here as well. Yeah, no doubt, and Laura, that is a, a busy intersection, busy part of town. We can give you a wider look at it uh, on our traffic maps here to show you exactly what we're talking about. Uh, we'll zoom in a little bit here and show you w exactly where this is taking place. You know 17A uh, Main Street, if you will, uh, getting close to uh, College Park Road there, and that is exactly where it happened. You see the red on the map. That is where the shooting occurred between Ricky Johnson and Berkeley County deputies, and they've been searching for him since a little after two o'clock this morning when, uh, according to the Berkeley County Sheriff's Office, he fired a shot at a deputy early this morning in the Wingate Mobile Home Park and then took off with his accomplice or passenger in the car, Vanessa Jo Bapp, the 32-year-old. She is still on the run right now, uh, according to the Sheriff's Office. They made no mention of her being at the scene or involved in this shootout uh, that occurred a little after 11 o'clock this morning. But again, Ricky Johnson in custody on his way to the hospital. No word yet on his condition, but the best news of all, no law enforcement injured in that shootout a little while ago. We'll keep our eyes on this. Any new information we'll get to you before we go off the air here at noon. You can also keep up with us online at count2.com, Facebook and Twitter as well. We're coming right back.